You going to the beach today? Yeah, I think it's open now. What? The beach? The beach was closed out here for a week. Why? Bacteria in the water. We're Is getting it set up. Morning? It's Monday. I mean, uh, a little before nines. There's a few vendors missing today. You want the bacteria? In the water. Oh, the <laughs> Mr. Angel. Uh, On Saturday morning. <laughs> Here comes the best of it. Last weekend she got sick. Along with that. This weekend, dog, uh, she got something sick. One of my return customers just brought me a Swiss Army knife. He wants me to clean it up and sharpen it. Bring it back next Saturday. But it doesn't need anything. The blades are like razor sharp on it now. I told him that. I told him I'd just clean it up for him so with my buffer and all when I get home. You remember last week they were standing in line at the bread stand. Not no one there today. The vegetable guy up at the end has got a little line. And the seafood guy right here has got a short line. People are starting to wander in now. Second customer has brought us a Boy Scout night. An old Boy Scout night. He wants it next Saturday. He wants it cleaned up, sharpened. He's going to give it back to his father. And he brought me a, like a Bowie knife. I'm not going to take it out. You can tell what it is by looking at it. Stainless steel, Pakistan. And then a fella just brought me this big Victinox Forester. It's like a foot long. Let's see how long it is. It is a foot long, exactly. Hello. I'm working on it now. On the uh, Cali. Stand by. You can see this old Boy Scout knife is in good shape. It's just got some tarnish on it. I just bought a nice buffer. A two-speed, one-horsepower buffer. This will be perfect for it. I don't know if I'll have it before Tuesday or Wednesday, but I've been shopping buffers now for two weeks. And I'll do a video on it when I get it, but... If you want to see what it looks like, you just Google Eastwood. Eastwood buffers. They make two kinds, a three-quarter horsepower and a one horsepower. I got the one horsepower for 10-inch buffing wheels. She'll turn out okay. third customer just brought me uh, two Wistoffs and a shun. I should say the fourth customer. A little utility slicer. Uh, serrated utility bread kitchen knife. And a little like a para, four inch shun para. Nice knife. Stand by. My last customer day brought me a whole flock of uh, emerald Degasi knives. Made in China. But they're all sharpened up, ready to a return. As we're closing down, I got 
Two of these. I'm going to take them out in the sunshine so you can see them. They're cutters, leather cutters. See what I mean? They're banged up, bad shape. That one is. This one is sort of the same way. She makes dog collars, this lady does. Leather dog collars. And these are the punches that she uses to punch out the different size ends and so on and so forth. Pretty cool. Homework. More homework. You never know what you're going to run into. It's sort of like detecting. I was all packed up, getting ready to go. The lady walked up and says, look at this, can you fix it? She had a nice boost off. Look at that. Let me get out in the sun where you can see it. She dropped it in the garbage disposal. So the tip's gone. Got a major chip right there. Needs a little tune up, as I would say. <laughs> I'll give you the after later. Stand by. Well, as I was leaving, I think I showed you some pictures of this earlier. Guy brought it by a Gurker. And the two little side knives. They have a name, but I don't know what they are right this minute. This is a, uh, it's got a bad spot right there on it. At first he was just going to leave it as it is. It's, it's, uh, it's like a show. I think I told you it's like a show. It has never had a blade on it. It's like, it's rounded off. It's probably, I mean, you know, you, you, can, you can't cut anything on it. It's never been sharp. Never been designed to be sharp. But he called me as I was pulling out. He said, hold it, hold it. I'm going to give you that Gurkha. I want you to sharpen it up for me. I said, okay. And the same with the little ones. They've never been sharp either. They're just like the big one, except smaller scale. That's a major job right there. Okay. That's it. Update. I got lots of homework. Well, now grass. Stand by. Well, the chip's out. He's all fixed up. We'll take her back to her in a minute. Sharp, too. Nice wool stalk. Keep the 